Hi mom, yeah we're good. Walk outside. Hello. Oh. Hey Abby, welcome. Good afternoon, good, good afternoon everyone, how's it going? My name is Max Roach and I am a person and today I've got something fun planned. Oh. Look at this. This is a Sigma lens. If we open up the box here and open it up, you can clearly see that this lens is clearly absolutely humongous. It is it is huge and it, it takes me a bit of effort to get it out. It's really wedged in there. <sighs> Stuck. Ah, come on. That's a stupid lens hood. Give me a give me a second. I'm just gonna get it actually out of the box. After all of that, I managed to get it out, and here it is. This is the Sigma 300 mm Prime f2.5, and it's vintage as well. FD mounted lens by Sigma for Nikon cameras, and it has autofocus as well. Look at this beast of a lens. The optic is absolutely humongous. Now you may be wondering, Max, this doesn't even this doesn't even this doesn't even fit your camera. So um, I have a camera that does fit. Let me just um, there we go. You can see me now. So basically, recently my uncle got in touch with me and was like, I saw your video about vintage lenses, and I've got one here that I'd quite like you to try out and this is what he was talking about it comes in a massive <laughs> box it comes in a massive metal box and um, he got this absolutely ages ago he says it's worth a try uh, very kindly lended me the lens as well as his his old nikon camera it's so i can actually use it as well as a monopod um just to just to try out and see what i can capture with it this thing <laughs> it's heavy it is incredibly heavy thank you to my uncle who's probably watching this so thank you this is really cool i can't wait to give it a try i've never used anything like this in my life and I probably won't for a long time, so thank you. <laughs> so this is a really cool lens. Uh, for starters, it's FD mounted, so it's a, it's, a, it's an old boy. It's chunky, it's very heavy, needs a monopod attachment to it so it can actually hold itself, or a tripod mount, it depends on what you want. The optic is literally, it's the size of my head, basically. Well, not really, but it's the size of my hand. It's, yeah, it's huge. My biggest lens at the moment, this is a 75 to 300. 75 to 300. This is a straight 300 in this little bag here. This is a Sigma converter. So this makes it into a 600 lens. <laughs> I've never used something this big before. Um, it's very large. It's going to be really interesting to get views from my room. I have already tried out some photos with it. I'm going to try out some more throughout the week. See what I can capture. I, I mean, the results would be absolutely incredible. The focus ring is like here, what's really cool. Uh, it does also come with this massive lens hood that could work as a hat, but Imagine turning up for a shoot and someone rocks up, there's this. This is basically, this is like blaster rifle, it's huge. <laughs> also a cool thing that it has on it is filters. So the filters are really nifty, yeah, it actually comes with some filters. Let me grab them actually for a second. So it comes with these really cool Sigma filters. Uh, as you can see, they have loads of different colors. They have orange one, yellow, red, and a nice little ND filter, very nifty. And you may be wondering, they're so small. They're tiny in comparison to the massive camera. How is that gonna work, Max? You ready for this? Hang on. Am I doing this one? It slides in and out. Tell me that isn't the coolest thing you've seen. And then all we have to do, pop open these filters, bada bing bada boom, just take out, I don't know, let's go crazy, let's go orange. But these filters are tiny. Look, that's, that. <laughs> I really like it. It's a cool little orange filter, like a monocle. And basically what we do, we just unscrew this here. Boop, 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 boop. Am I doing it the wrong way? It just takes a long time. Screw it on there. <laughs> it's very heavy. And then you just, Plop it back in, and you got a filter in there, ready to shoot. I think I'm gonna wait a moment. I'm gonna wait till sunset. Get some really nice views out my window. Sunny day, so I reckon I'm gonna get some really cool clouds. I reckon about seven o'clock, I'll be rejoining you with big boy lens, and we'll see what uh, stuff we can catch. <laughs> It's the right conditions. Just say sunset and stuff was not great. So I thought there's no point. I'll leave it. I have to, I have the lens for like a week. So I have time. So I might be posting more pictures that I maybe am not taking tonight. This is a uh, this is kind of insane. Right, I'm positioning over here. So I've got the adapter on it as well. So it's going six six hundred at the moment. And this is just insane. Now it's time for the photos. Thank you.
thank you for joining me. Hopefully you enjoyed the photos. I had an in the They could be absolutely trash. I've never used a Nikon before and it's been an experience to say the least. Make sure you check out the other videos on the channel and also be aware for other videos by clicking subscribe. That'd be absolutely amazing. Thank you for that. See you lads. Goodbye. Bye.